Welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, welcome to the boat gang. I got the Horizon Harbor tug on the block, on the block. Uh, today we're going to be installing an FPV camera in the tugboat. This is the Horizon Harbor tug by Pro Boat. All right, it's a recovery boat. It actually, uh, if you flip a fast electric boat, we can go out and recover the fast electric boat with the tugboat. The problem is I'm getting old. All right, my eyesight isn't what it used to be, okay? And uh, I, I think one of my subscribers may have picked up on that. So he actually sent, Michael, thank you, brother, one of my subscribers sent me a Red Paws uh, goggles, monitor, and FPV camera, all right? Uh, we're going to install it on the tugboat. It's pretty freaking cool, man. It's pretty cool. We're going to be able to do long-distance rescues on the fly. FPV style. I am stoked. All right, it's got this little module here. Forgive me because I do not know what all this good stuff's called. So if I butcher, botch, or, or, or murder uh, the, the correct names for all the goodies here, give cut me some slack because I've never done this. I'm a boat guy. I don't even know what half of this stuff is. Okay, I, I was guessing when I hooked up the antennas. <laughs> But I got it working. It's working. So we're going to install it. All right. Uh, stick around. Stick around. It should be a fun little video. Then we'll take it out for its first rip or first rescue or FPV freestyle, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> stick around. So let's get to it. Let's get to it. All right. Um, well, I guess that died. I guess we need to put it on charge. So I guess I'll show you that what this is first um first off i just want to give a big thanks to michael he, dude i dude that's freaking awesome man thank you man i i wasn't expecting this i wasn't expecting it to be actually so easy to get going i mean it was actually pretty simple i was amazed but i've got this uh it's a red pause don't know the model numbers and all that i, I could look at my emails he sent me and probably put something in the description for you guys but uh, it's got all the bells and whistles, I guess. Uh, antennas, those are cool. And uh, on-off button, scan button, search button, and we get we can put an SD card in it. We can record a picture, okay? And uh, channel band plus plus, I don't know. But it actually, we could put it on a tripod. When I'm doing my rescue, I could kind of bring you guys along for the ride. All right. Well, since we're on camera subject, let me show you guys. I've had a lot of requests on what I use to record my running videos, like while I'm running my boats. Let me let me get what let me get it for you. So so what I use for filming, I use this uh, neck mount. All right. It's actually broke a few times and I've iron cladded it out. I super glued and baking powdered it. But I put my phone in it. Okay. I use this Samsung S20 Ultra. All right. You guys see it on the on the little screen there. S20 Ultra is what I use to record all of my footage at the pond. All right. This is a neck mount. Okay. It just goes around your neck. Okay. And it hangs from your neck. It kind of looks silly. You put your phone right there. You hang it from your neck. But it, And it kind of looks silly when you're wearing it around your neck like a necklace. But it, it, it sits on your chest. Like this piece right here. Like this piece right here actually sits on your chest. Like the top part of your chest. And uh, you know with a head mount with, with a camera. You know you're always moving your head around. With this you kind of just kind of sit still. And, and it and it, and it don't really move around a whole lot and I just use my s20 ultra to film you know like it's pretty simple it's pretty simple setup all right so I use like a little axial self tapping screw okay I use it right there in that block of wood I mounted up my my camera mount all right I'm just gonna put my two screws in there so I can move it up and down all right I'll also be able to kind of move it side to side if I need to okay uh, I guess next thing we need to do is um, drill a hole in the top of the the wheelhouse here for that uh, video antenna. Okay, this um, 40 channel 5 giga 5G8 mini 200. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. All right. So um, let me get the camera mounted up. We'll drill a hole and mount that guy right there. All right. So I got my camera mounted up. Okay, um, I got this kind of set off to the side. Let's see how the view is. I got the viewfinder on. 
or the monitor or the goggle set on. Oh, that's cool. Oh, man. I hope. Damn, I wish I would have mounted it forward some. Jeez, I might. I might do that. I really didn't want the wheelhouse. Uh, I really didn't want the edge of the wheelhouse showing. You know, I got I got super glue over my fingers. So let's see. Oh, I still like that. I wanted the full panoramic view. So I think I'm gonna re-drill. I think I'm gonna re-drill that and mount it closer to uh, the forward part of this block real quick. All right, so I repositioned it farther forward. Let's see how that do goes. I need, I probably need to tighten it up a little bit more. Oh yeah, that's gonna be good. So actually, that's a lot better. You see where the camera's at? It's kind of sticking out the wheelhouse, so we don't have that, uh, the the edge of the, the window showing, you know? Um, See if I can push it down some. Yeah, see the boat in front of it? All right, you see the little recoil too here? All right, that's gonna be perfect. If I would have mounted it up here, I probably would have had a better view. Okay, if I would have mounted it up top. But I think that's gonna be Put good. the arm out. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna be able to see the arms and around us. You see how much, you know, it's like a panoramic view or whatnot. So that's gonna work, that's gonna work. All right, it's kind of sticking out the wheelhouse there. It's protected if it gets wet. Uh, so yeah, let's ant antenna time, antenna time. It's really like the cool part of the hobby to me. You know, I've never done this before. I've never done this. It's kind of outside of my realm, my, my box, you know? And uh, it's really neat, you know, this is cool. Like. Uh, being able to, you know, do something like this to your RC boat, you know, uh, something you don't know, normally see every day, you know, and, and that's like lights on an RC boat, you know, uh, that's cool. Like, it, it, and a lot of people don't really, you know, do the whole light deal, you know, but it's actually really, really fun hooking lights up on your boat. I used to have a boat that was all decked out in lights and it was actually like a fun project. All right. So I got that antenna right there. Okay, with my little chipboard thing in here. This is Velcro. This is like that kind of heavy duty, medium duty Velcro. I'm just gonna put it on the bottom of my battery. So I actually need to get some heat shrink. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this plug out and get some heat shrink and shrink over these wires, I guess. Um, I got some heat shrink that I actually just kind of sh shrink wrapped a few sections of my my little wire harness here. Uh, full disclaimer, this is my first time doing this. So if you guys are watching this and you want to copy what I'm doing, just know there may be a better way. So I got that light on. I got my battery Velcro down on the deck. Uh, just, I'm just going to put my hatch, my, my cabin on. Careful not to scratch up my lens. Alright. And then, something hold me up here. Oh, there we go. I just had it, had the camera sitting right on the, on the cabin. Hopefully it's not that hard putting it on every single time. So yeah, you guys, that's basically <laughs> how you install an FPV camera on your Horizon Harbor tug. I think that would be a great freaking option part from Horizon Har Hobby. You know, Probo is, is a, a kit to hook up an FPV camera on the tugboat for long-range missions, you know, recoveries. So um, I was going to run the boat. At the end of the video, it's already kind of a long video, so I'm going to let you guys go, all right? We're going to take the boat out in the next video, along with this boat, maybe another boat, and uh, whoever flips first, it's rescue time. <laughs> all right, so uh, appreciate you guys watching. I hope this little uh, uh, tutorial helps. Uh, a big thanks to my subscriber who sent the, the FPV uh, gear. Thank you, brother. I appreciate it. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Help us, helps you out with your build.